Well, Mrs. McCarthy, how are you today? I'm good. How are you guys? Fine, thank you. Do you enjoy your job? Oh, I love my job. It's lots of fun. That's good. <laughs> uh, do you often catch kids trying to leave the school? Well, in my office, I have security cameras, so I can see students leaving and coming and going. But when it gets really busy, I don't know if you've ever checked out before or not. But um, some students have gone out, and I have to yell and, "Hey, where are you going?" But they often come back. Or, um, you know, sometimes we've had students sneak out other doors, and that's often <laughs> Officer Moore's job to get them. So, consider yourself the guardian of the school. Um, in a roundabout way, I think I am because, you know, at 7:25 the doors locked. So the only way you can get in is through door number 12. So um, I watch out for everybody. I make sure you're all here safe and sound. Have you had any tough engagements with students? Me? Yeah. <laughs> of course I have. Would you like to share? Well, it's, you know, anytime after 725, that's, you're supposed to be in your seat, seated at 725. That's when school begins. And, you know, oftentimes the students blame me for their tardiness. Well, it's not my fault. So if I have to give you detention after four times, then, you know, sometimes they're not very nice about it. And, you know, they're, they're mad and upset that they have to serve a detention. But that's the rules of the school. You're the one that has to administer the detention. Yes, I am. So, but I'm leaning on, you know, at times, you know, I can understand, especially like if it's 726 or 727 or something, but when you're a half an hour, 45 minutes late with no call in, mm -hmm. then, you know, then you're going to have to, but it's four times, so, and it doesn't set by quarter, it sets by semester. So a lot of students think, oh, I'm in the clear after the second second quarter, and no, <laughs> you are not. Yeah, they do. They do force the bad cop and make me look like the bad person. And then I've often heard that students are in complaining about Mrs. McCarthy, how mean I am. But it's not my problem. That's fair enough. <laughs> what is something you wish you knew before you started working here? Um, I don't know, just the craziness of the job and the nature of the job. I mean, a lot of times um, parents call in and I'm the first person who answers the phone. So, you know, I'm... The attendance, even though I'm not the attendance coordinator, I act as the attendance coordinator. I'm a psychologist, I'm a therapist. Um, you know, I've just got to be able to answer the call and make everybody, you know, set them straight and, and give them the correct answers and the right answers. And it does get crazy down there. So, yeah. Um, but other than that, I mean, I, I enjoy it and it's a lot of fun and I like getting to know all the students and the staff. So, other than that, I, I don't know if there would be much I'd change. If you had the decision to like not buzz someone in, you're like, oh, I hate this kid. I'm going to get them. <laughs> would you take advantage of that opportunity? No, because a lot of times I'm so busy that I don't even see who's walking in. I mean, most of the times I could be like, oh, here comes so-and-so in. But no, I would never let them stay out there. Yeah. yeah. Well, I would not try to sign myself out. All right. Yeah. That sounds good because I won't let you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Yeah, thank you very much.